presentation. So I'm Maria Elena Vera Vélez, and I will give you my uh, overview of my lesson plan. The strategy I'm going, that I'm going to use is some challenge. I have 15 students in pre-production pre stage, six in early production, five in speech emergency, uh, three in intermediate, and one in advance. The content <coughs> objective I have is students will identify the different occupations making a conversation in order to use them in their daily life. The vocabulary I, that I'm going to use is pilot for pre-production, driver for ear production, carpenter for, for speech emergency, and hairdresser for intermediate, and web designer for advanced. Okay, I'm gonna uh, start with a quote that was interesting for me. Education is the passport to the future, but tomorrow belongs to those who prepare for it today. Um, I have learned some critical concepts he here in this program. But I chose five of them, uh, which are the most important for me. The first one is affective filter. Uh, the lower of the affective filter is the high level of acquisition the student have. This is the most important for me. So I want to show the other one I chose. Comprehension, input visuals, states of mind, and co grouping configuration. So, let's start with my class. Good morning, good afternoon, students. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you today? Fine. Okay. So, as you remember, yesterday we start with this lesson. Do you remember the name of the lesson? The name of the lesson is occupations. Very good. So, uh, let's, let's uh, read the, the objectives I have, we, we have for continuing our class. Um, and Mari, can you read the first objective, please? Try definitions of new words using our predictions in first. Jenny? Uh, listening and add extra information on the stick notes. Talk about first. Write sentences and share to the whole class. Okay. So you have your your pet your pet already, so get together. Quickly please. Number two. Four. Six, 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 <laughs> okay, perfect. So I will give you back the the strip that we used yesterday. <laughs> On the phone, no? For the two. Teacher. Teacher. You have to. Sorry. Put me in. Oh, okay. Perfect. So, let's remember the occupation we do. We know already. Pilot. Pilot. Driver. Driver. Carpenter. Carpenter. Hairdresser. Hairdresser. And web designer. Web designer. Well, you already have your predictions in your strip. 
So I uh, I would like you remember. I would like to to uh, to hear that uh, which which were or which were your prediction. So uh, Veronica, tell me what you have in pilot. Uh, in pilot, I have airplane. Okay. Meg, Magus, what do you have in hairdresser? Hairdresser, it's a person who cuts your hair. Okay, Magus, what do you have in carpenter? It's a person who designs uh, furniture. Perfect. So, now I... Uh, do you remember the, the, the name of the, the strategy you are, going, you are using right now? Thumb challenge. Thumb challenge. Thumb challenge. Very good. So, this is the model we have, we have a very good hand. So now I want to give you more information about the, those uh, occupations. So a pilot, a pilot is a person who operates aircraft. A driver, who is a driver? Or what does a driver do? Driver drives cars and trucks. Very good. A carpenter makes things out of wood. Hairdresser and styles hair. A web designer creates websites. Very good. Now you are going to use your sticky nose that is going to give you. You are going to stick on each word and you are going to add. Add information according to what I, s what I already said. Okay? Add information in your sticky note. Okay, are you done? Okay, very good. What about you, Lady? Uh, my favorite occupation is hairdressing. Hairdressing, what do you have to hairdress? Um, with my cats and crazy hairstyles. <laughs> <laughs> I like your definition and information. Okay, now we are going to work on a task. We are going to complete, complete sentences. So. Uh, we are going to fill the, blank, the blanks with uh, the, the word of occupations. A blank operates aircraft. Who operates aircraft? Pilot. Pilot. Very good. Second one. A blank drive car and trucks. Driver. 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 A blank makes things out of, out of wood. Carpenter. 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 Very good. Add uh, blank, blank cut and style hair. Hair, hair dresser. Hair dresser. Excellent. And a uh, blank create websites. A 
Very good. Now you are going to write your own sentences in your notebook. Okay? okay. According to the, the, your favorite, your favorite um, occupation. And we are going to share with the whole class. Every month to cook my hair. <laughs> oh, very good. Magus? I would like to be a pilot in order to travel around the world without paying any money. <laughs> oh, nice. So, thank you very much for co collaborating with my classes. You did a great job. Okay, so I'm going to conclude with my presentation. Uh, I would like to say I use this strategy because it helps my students to learn vocabulary in a fun and interactive way. And also, I would like to say that this program helped me to grow personally um, in the way that I can realize that I'm not just a I know I'm not only a teacher. I am a friend of my students. And this is why I need to help them to grow academically with my, with in, in, with my best way to teach them. Um, pro professionally, it helped me to, to learn some strategies and approaches that I'm going to use in my professional practice when I come back to Ecuador. And finally, I would like to say this program, Go Teacher, was a wonderful experience. Thank you very much.